All right, a lot of people ask, how do you manage existing reports? I want to give you a couple big tips about that. So um, let's say uh, somebody else made this report for you, or maybe you even made this report a few months ago. Uh, here's one of the first things I would do with an existing report. I would go into the database expert. I'm going to pick on database, database expert. Because over here on the right-hand side of the database expert, it tells you where that report is getting its uh, data from. So in this case, we can see it's coming from an Excel spreadsheet. This is the workbook, and this is the sheet within that workbook. So that's a really uh, important piece of information. Now I know where the uh, report's getting its data from. Sometimes you'll see multiple tables there, of course. So what I did was database and then database expert. Uh, so now another thing I'll do is I'll start experimenting with the field. So if you move your mouse around a field, it's going to give you some important information. It tells you the table name it came from, the field name, and the data type. So here we can see this is from the Europe expenses table, the country field, and the, uh, it's a string or a text type of field. So that's another big clue when you're managing uh, an existing report. You want to see where the fields are coming from. Then uh, if you go up here, you can start to look at the database fields that those are all the fields that are available through that table or through multiple tables. Then you might see if there's any formulas in there. You might see if there's any uh, parameters are when the, um, when the report asks the user for the criteria. That's called a parameter. You might see if there's running totals. We have a video about running totals here. Uh, there might be um, the groups. Uh, it can tell you how the report is grouped by. So these are just ways uh, that are very interesting to start to um, understand what it is about an existing report. The Field Explorer is always very helpful, all right? especially with the, uh, the database fields, the formula fields. You can start to see what's going on. Now, another thing that might help you is the, re uh, the report expert. I'm going to pick on View and then the Report Explorer. And then it kind of shows you what different fields are in what different sections. So that, that is a different way to look at the report, and that can help you as well. Uh, all of the videos that I have will work with new reports and also existing reports, you know. But these couple tips specifically will help with existing reports.